I don't think you understand, Dr. Petruger. No, I understand everything. I'm telling you now, Doctor, the UAC is taking over this operation. Operation? Is that what you're calling it? The situation is out of control. It's not out of control, Swan. You are. I'll manage this, and you and your flunky will be taking control of nothing. Do you understand? Yes, Petruger. I think I do understand. Okay, plan B. Welcome to the Alpha Labs, formerly designated by the Union Aerospace Off-World Research Division. The Alpha Labs began construction on October 29, 2095, and became fully operational July 17, 2130. Originally created as the Prime Science and Research Facility, Alpha Labs are responsible for the development of... Stop, buddy. There's nothing you can do for me. They're all gone. <coughs> Surprised us. They just came out of nowhere.
Marine. Bravo team reports there's some sort of unidentified growth taking over parts of the base. I don't know what it is, but it can't be good. Stay sharp. Access the system somewhere else. All right, let's go. is the audio log of Director William Banks, dated October 20th, 2145. It has come to my attention that we have an alarming number of missing personnel in the My office has received four additional reports from Delta in the last week alone, mentioning that personnel are not reporting for work, that calls to their quarters have gone unanswered. My office has sent the names of those personnel to Mars Security to initiate an investigation, but this news is very disturbing, especially at a time when we have so many people in the infirmary suffering from sudden cases of schizophrenia and other psychological disorders. I hope there is no connection between those cases and these reports of missing personnel. This is the audio log of Director William Banks, dated October 5th, 2145. It has been brought to my attention by environmental services that the recent power grid changes have caused many non-critical systems to malfunction. The report explains that this is due to either intermittent power outages or lower than optimal voltage input. It also says that sufficient power distribution to all non-critical systems is becoming more difficult to maintain thanks to Dr. Betruger and his so-called optimizations to the energy stores in and around the facility. I assured the director of ES that I would file a report with central authority over this.
This is Paul Simon, security specialist in IT. Our network security has been breached several times over the last few days. Now, it looks like it may have been going on longer than that, but whoever did this really knew what they were doing. They covered the tracks really well. I just happened to notice some log anomalies or it would still be going on. The intrusion came on an encrypted carrier signal from the Delta complex. They piggybacked the virus on one of the supercomputer